Hey, what's up everyone? This is Ron Simplify, Myers Job Lifting Life Partner. Just wanted to come to you guys, give you a quick video. Uh, I was reading a book and a gentleman was talking about how as men we're here to protect our women and that type of stuff. And they went on to give an illustration uh, in terms of them being out on a boat, their wife liking to be in the water. Um, I don't remember if the person didn't like to swim or um, what the issue was, but they couldn't go in the water so they felt like they couldn't protect their wife so they felt the best thing was for the wife not to be in the water and that's called protecting your wife um and to each his own i'm not here to say right or wrong as you guys know i personally had a challenge with that because for me uh what you did is you protected your wife from actually enjoying things that she enjoys in life i don't think that's good if she enjoys the water, then she should be able to be in the water. If you can't swim, or if you have whatever issues it is about water, you need to overcome those and then get in the water and protect if that's what you want to call it. But do not stop people from doing the things that they enjoy in life and then you justify it by saying, I'm trying to protect you. No, folks, this is about allowing people to be who they are. You've heard me say that many times before in communication. Those are two keys to relationships. Do not, and this includes those of you who, when you get together with someone, they ride a motorcycle. You knew they ride a motorcycle. You know they love motorcycles. You get married, have kids. You tell them they can't ride a motorcycle any, anymore. Don't marry them to begin with. Don't have kids with them. Don't be in a relationship with them. There's nothing to me worse than getting in a relationship with someone and then taking something from them that they have a passion for. They folks, they will resent you for it. And it may not show up on, in this case, like the motorcycle or getting in the water, but it will show up in other areas of your relationship. They'll start to resent you. Why? You took away something from them that they really enjoyed doing and they didn't do it because they wanted to. They did it because they had to be, as you call it, responsible. So, folks, if you can't live with it, it's the same thing if you marry a police officer. You can't tell them not to leave the house because you're afraid they might get killed today. You knew that when you got with that person. So if those are challenges that you have, then you don't need to be with that particular individual. Again, allow people to be themselves. That's why I said that's one of the two keys. Because then I get to decide on whether I want to hang out with you or not. But it's not my job or it's not fair to get in a relationship with you and then stop you from doing the things that you love to do. And as you guys know, it ain't right, it ain't wrong. It is my opinion. Oh, I know. I look kind of rough today. Uh, I've been just hanging out here, just sitting here kind of working on my book a little bit. But I decided that was something that I really wanted was on my heart, wanted to share it. So you guys know be you. I love you guys all. Talk to you. Bye.